Dan Page Jr. and today I'm going to give you some advice on how to make your comic book the greatest thing of all time. Some of you may have known if you watched my previous videos or whatever. I have been working on a comic book series called Nexus. I have been doing it for over a year now and through that year of me working on it I have learned a lot of things on just how to write and all that. But this is making me, teaching me, taught me how to a lot of interesting things that I feel like can help people like you who are trying to do the same thing. So one of the most important things that I kind of wish I did a little earlier was uh, draw the characters out. Because um, most of my characters in my, in, in my comic book series, their faces differ all the time because there's no like real clear idea of what these people look like. You know, it just kind of now started being a little more consistent. Yeah, just draw every character you have in your story, just in every single angle. You know, and just to base to get an idea of what they look like, like what's their build. Like, are they really muscly? Are they really skinny or something like that? Just stuff like that. Just draw it out so that you have no, you have like you know, you just have that in the back of your mind when you're drawing it. You know, so you don't get confused. Or best to have those things in mind when you're, you know, creating, you're drawing the series. So you can have to draw these characters like a lot. So, you know, I think drawing them out before you start is you know, a good uh, thing. Another important thing is to try not to be too dialogue heavy. Now, I've mentioned this in so many videos, so many times, right? Because exposition can make and break a whole story. When you're making a comic book or a movie or just practically anything where you have to look at it, you don't really need to say much. Like, look at 2001 Space Odyssey, right? And then they didn't tell you shit in that movie. That movie can be interpreted any way it wants because it doesn't have a real clear, like, it doesn't, get, it doesn't turn on the lights. It don't tell you everything that's going on in the movie. It's up for interpretation. And, you know, you just leave it like that. You don't need to do too much dialogue. You know what I mean? And personally, for me, I don't like it. You know, I've seen so like things in comic books that popular, like people just, you know, talking all through the fucking panel. And it's just, I don't want to, you know, you don't want to read all that. You don't need to explain everything a person does. You could show it. It's a visual medium. So use that to your advantage. Another important thing, and this is, um, try not to think too hard about your story. But I have a problem, and I, I like to think a lot, so I always like to go into, I always like to go real, to take deep dives into my own story. That may sound narcissistic, but whatever. I always do that, you know, but, and so it ends up getting a lot confusing, and the characters end up getting messed up a little bit. Um... <clears throat> But yeah, try not to think too hard about it. You know what I mean? Simplify it to its very basic core. Like, this is what's going on in the story. This is what's happening. You know, the harder you think about it, the harder it becomes to write. And the harder it becomes to write, you don't do it. You know, you throw it away. Just try and not think too hard about it. Don't make it too complicated for your brain to understand. And you will be able to move a little quicker. That's really for the overthinkers, really, because I, you know, I think a lot, so that kind of happens all the time. And one final thing I want to mention is don't be afraid of the art being trash. You're gonna grow as an artist as you're doing this. You're gonna learn more things, and you're gonna know, learn new things that you wish you could have done earlier. And that's only gonna happen when you do it. So don't worry too much about being good, you know, and don't worry too much about if it looks good or if it's up to this, whatever. That doesn't matter. The whole idea is to just have, is to get the story across. If it's, if I can read it, if I can see it, then you did your job. I'm not telling you to settle. I'm not saying that. I'm saying get it out there. Just finish it. Get it done. You know, regardless of how bad the art looks, because that's gonna come with time. It's gonna look good in time. Uh, so yeah, just if you just make those are just little things I learned. I'm pretty sure I'm still like learning. You know, um, yeah, another thing I want to mention is anatomy. Um, 
just you know maybe look up a picture of like how the human body like works you know the male and female body how it works or how it looks you know and because you it help it, just to help you better understand maneuver characters a little bit better and all that also one trick i would do is it's, it's something it helps me like get better if i don't know how to draw something i just draw it all the times so like when i didn't know i didn't know how to draw characters in a side view so i just kept drawing characters in side views until i got it or how i don't don't know how to draw hands and so i make characters do a lot of things kind of i put their hands like out another problem i had was uh foreshortening you know like how things get stretched or squeezed in when something's pointing directly at the camera. I had no idea how to do that, and so I just do it more. You know, just try and do my goal. What I would do, you don't have to do. What I would do is just try and do more what you don't know how to do. Okay, so yeah, that's uh, the video. Make sure you subscribe. We're so close. We are real close. Not close. Um, we're slowly, but very surely hitting my 1 million subscriber goal. I know we have 300 right now, but we're... It's a slow burn, it's getting there, it's getting there. Trust me, you're gonna see the gold plaque. For when you're gonna see it, I promise you. Um, yeah, so make sure you subscribe, and like, and comment, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm getting the